hello friends welcome to today tutorial session today uh, i'm going to uh, teach you how to export your database mysql this is on 4.4 version when you export a database from mysql and try to import into mysql 5.5 it gives you an error called unknown collation utf h and before unicode ci you can see there this error is appearing in the line so this cannot be resolved so there is a safe another way to export the database from the server so please follow the steps and export the database once you export it successfully you will be able to import the database we can log into your server from where you want to export the database the old database in the old database you have two options for exporting that is the quick and custom so quick method by default it will be export all the options now you have to select custom you can see over there there is the option table then there is the output the database name and the format the very most important thing you have to remember that there is something called format specific options you go to the format specific option and you can see over here there is something called database system or older MySQL server to maximize output compatibility with there are several options you need to select it so here you have to select MySQL 40 you can see there I am selecting MySQL 40 now select and now you export Remind, remember one thing you should not check any other options except database system or older MySQL server to maximize output compatibility with MySQL 40. Now you export the database. Now we will save the database. Once your database is saved, now go to the your another server or the updated mysql server now click on import now you select your the database name and just click go wait for some time the database import is started and it will take few seconds depending on the size to restore your database now you can see over here the import has been successfully finished and whatever the query you have it has been imported so once again i'm repeating you all to go to your older version of mysql click on export select custom options go to format specific options and select the this options database system or older mysql server to maximize output compatibility with mysql 40 remember you have to select from the drop down mysql 40 and export it once you ex export you will be able to resolve the error thank you for watching